Back in the day, Newsboys and DC Talk were rivals. If you were a DC Talk fan, you were probably a Newsboys fan. They came to the States, we took them on tour with us the first time, and um, that was quite a tour. Peter Furler, John James, man, those cats from the, from the, from the old days. But looking back now, I would have never thought, first of all, in a million years, I'd be in the Newsboys. And as Grandma always said to me, Grandma said, honey, God works in mischievous ways, <laughs> meaning mysterious ways. But um, yeah, yeah, um, Wes Campbell, uh, through Duncan Phillips, <laughs> getting my number from True Artist Management, came to me and asked, he says, would you be um, interested in taking over the band for a while, as he said. And I later found out that Peter wanted to take a break, um, spend time with his family, you know, um, he's done it for 20 years. You, know, you, can, you can get burned out, yeah. So I thought initially that it was just gonna be just for a while. Au contraire. 600 shows later, I'm still here. Hey, what's up? Michael from the Newsboys. Thanks for watching this video on BeliefNet. Check out our brand new live record, God's Not Dead.